Hi everyone, this is James, this is Eurovision Ireland, and this is Review in Two, where of course we have two minutes or less to talk about all the songs heading to the Eurovision Song Contest in Rotterdam this year. Before we get to today's song, please take a moment to make sure you are subscribed to our channel so you don't miss out on any future videos, because of course we are going to be covering all the songs that are heading to Rotterdam this year. And also, if you'd like to leave a like or a comment, please feel free to do so. So, without further ado, let's open up to Eurovision 2021. Next up, it's that most Eurovision country of all, Australia, Montaigne and Technicolor. I have a lot of friends in Australia and people I'm very close to who live there, so I feel like I have to be really, really positive about this song. The difficulty is, I don't think it's the strongest entry that we've ever seen from Australia. Now, that doesn't mean that I don't like it, I think it does have its strong points, but for me, it feels a bit chaotic in the delivery. Now, what I mean by that is, we start out sort of very New Age and ooh, you know, okay, that's one style of music. Then we sort of go into, you know, pop and lock sort of do music, which again is a bit jarring. And until about five minutes ago, I honestly thought the lyric was time to take off your clothes. Turns out it's time to take off your cloaks, which okay, has a slightly different meaning. But yeah, it was just sort of three very jarring things, very close together. Now, if it was any other singer delivering this song, I'd worry about Australia's chances. But being Montaigne and knowing what an absolute dynamo of a performer she is, I'm a little more confident for them. Ever since I saw Montaigne in the Australian National Selection last year, sort of doing her rendition of Clown being committed to a mental asylum, you know, okay, we all laughed and thought it was really weird, but I looked at it and said, as performance art, that is genius. And I think if she can do something equally memorable for the stage in Rotterdam, then I don't think Australia are completely out of luck with it. Time to take off your clothes. So that was my review in two, hope you enjoyed it. Just remember these videos are my personal comments and thoughts on songs influenced by my taste in music. If you want to get in touch you can do so by the comments below, I'll be replying personally to all your comments in the coming weeks and months. So make sure you keep checking back to Eurovision for all the goings on for Eurovision 2021. That's all for now, take care Europe, thank you and good night.